One winter evening, Henry played driver too. The fat controller. Yeah. We got ourselves the flying kipper. I found out Henry, and he's real useful. Get your butt over here before you crash. Yes, I think if we pull off Gordon nicely, the fat controller will let us pull off the butler. Hurrah! Cried Henry. That must be love. Come here. They unload the come from the key. Key. Henry's clock was ready at five o'clock. There was frost. The last door banged. The guard showed his green penis. The flying skipper was ready to go. The points were frozen, and the home signal should have been set at danger. But the force had forced it down. Sorry, my lady. Kipper is of you, said God. Go. I am Coco, said the fireman. <laughs> Henry Lee. Days the confused. The fat controller's fine dick came inside Henry's firebox. Whoosh! Ice tea caused the accident. I don't care if it blows up. I'm sending you a fine. You'll feel a lot of little children. Children! One day, Thomas was shuffling. <laughs> What a mark. I can't smell, said Annie. Thomas enjoyed tea. Do you know what I think? It doesn't matter what you <laughs> Annie and Claravel could hardly believe my ears. Would you make us ashamed? Thomas went off to mine some trucks. Long ago, miners had made it on the ground. Their roofs are strong enough to hold up trucks, but not the weight of it. Danger! You shall not pass. Silly old Borden fell in a ditch, pumping the trucks fiercely. He jerked off. Come, yelled his driver. Ah! I spunked. Thomas the tank engine has worked his money for many years. Do you know Thomas? I am Thomas. Thomas had become a suit. He didn't realize his driver was choking. Help! I'm choking! <laughs> coming out, coming out. You'd never dare. Huh. The next morning, the firefighter came. Percy and Toby were sheep. The cleaner had meddled with his control. He soon found his safe. Money's still tight. The station master was about to have Toby for breakfast. Thomas had collected travel on his travels. He peered into the room. The station master was furious. His wife picked, 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 picked up her bag one. Say the line. Wife, just look what you've done to our breakfast. Yeah. She banged the door. You're only supposed strong poles. Propped up the house with strong poles. Racers! Toby the tram engine has cow catchers. But I don't catch cows. Don't be funny. Okay. Daisy thought Toby was sending her yourself. You are. I, I, I just toot. Animals always run if you toot. And what can Bullshit Daisy has a mess up. At the next station, a policeman was waiting. It's only a waffer thing. I'll show Toby how to manage Bournemouth. Champion isn't really a bull. <laughs> this morning he was us. Suddenly he saw some ass. Now for my breakfast, he thought. Disgusting! Oh, this! It's all wrong. Ah, well, continued Toby. We can live in there. Toby's bell and rang and his woodley sounded. Daisy was feeling some boy's balls. And Alan goes, nuts.